Pro One Micro Hygiene Monitoring System and Mini Pro Auto Reader for the detection and quantification of surface proteins. Designed to detect and quantify residual proteins and iatrogenic agents on medical instrument surfaces after the cleaning process. A quick user guide. First, turn on your Mini Pro by connecting the power source. Now wait for it to reach the default temperature of 60 degrees Celsius. You can use the external thermometer to verify the temperature. You'll know when it's done when the temperature light stops blinking and remains on. Remember that the Pro One Micro should be stored vertically and refrigerated. Before swabbing, it's important to remove the Pro One Micro from the pouch and allow it to reach a temperature of 20 to 25 degrees Celsius. Now. Remove the swab from the device and carefully apply two drops of moisturizer on the swab tip. Rotate the swab after the first drop to be homogeneously hydrated and ensure the drops don't fall off the swab. Swab thoroughly the instrument's surface to be tested. It should be the most challenging area for removing the organic matter. Press the swab and rotate it several times while collecting the sample. Place the swab back in the device and activate it by pressing it firmly downwards. Shake it vigorously downwards for about 15 seconds. The solution must turn green. Slide the swab upwards and shake the device again to ensure all the liquid falls into the reading cone. After activation, the Pro One Micro must be incubated immediately. Hold the Position Pro button to enable the position's reading mode. Place the protein pen in the activated position. Ensure it is correctly inserted into the bottom of the position and the pen does not rotate. Hold the Pro button for one second again to start the incubation and wait for the result. The Pro One micro reading process takes four minutes in the Mini Pro Auto Reader and seven minutes in IC1020FR and IC1020FR LCD incubators. The color of the solution on the Pro One micro can be used for an optional qualitative reading only if the interpretation is done immediately after the protein pen is removed when the program ends, using the provided color card as a reference. If the protein pen is not removed as soon as a result is informed, the color of the solution will continue to evolve. For this reason, an audible alarm will be set off 30 seconds before the reading ends to warn the operator that the incubation time is about to finish. You can turn off the alarm by pressing the alarm button. When the incubation is completed, the Mini Pro will print the results and display a red or green light. Green light means the amount of residual protein swabbed is below the threshold set. Red light indicates the amount of residual protein swabbed is above the threshold set. Further details will be shown in the printed ticket. Also, you can use our exclusive Bionova cloud traceability software to track, save and manage all your readout processes. The example shown in this video was done following HTM0101 guidelines with a threshold of 5 micrograms. But we also developed a mobile app called Surface Eye, designed to comply with international standard ISO 15883 Part 5 2021. To configure the HTM or ISO thresholds on your auto reader, please refer to the user manual. Both modes are connected and integrated with BioNova Cloud. You can check the links in the description below to know more about BioNova Cloud and Surface Eye.